Good morning everyone, how are you? I hope everything will be alright. Mr. Dr. Udi Saman Hudi SPD MPD as a lecturer in the speaking course and all of my friends whom I am proud of. Introduce my name, Widi Silva Julianti, I am from class 3A. Um, okay, my friend, in this presentation, we will discuss about why people are becoming idiots with technology. Okay, let's go straight to the material. Einstein was born in 1879, three years after the invention of the telephone. Einstein was the bird, the owner of the British brain in the 20th century. Once predicted, I fear today technology will surpass our human interaction. The world will have a generation of idiots. Really Einstein, just look around us. People everywhere are like gluing themselves to their selfies or mobile phone. While eating in a restaurant with the family or watching a tennis match even when riding or a bicycle or motorbike, the A's are always fixed on the cell phone screen. Do we really have to look at the cell phone screen every second? No matter being with other people or stranded far away in the countryside, cell phones have become an inspirable part of the body. The universe seems to be something that is no more important than gadgets. A serpent in the UK, conducted by a digital marketing company, found that in the UK, the average person uses a smartphone 221 times every day. Star pressing the smartphone button at the seven house three minutes and it a twenty three house three minutes in the early morning. What if the average number is taken? Then people in England have their eyes attached to the cell phone screen for three hours and fifteen minutes a day. Three hours and fifteen minutes depend from the surrounding environment body and soul strength in the real of the cyberspace, the impact, humans and the humanage, face-to-face -face interaction, face-to-face engineering are increasingly rare without face-to-face -face interaction, humans will be an idiot species. Here are 11 insights of changing the way we live due to technology. 1. The exclusivity of friends began to pay smartphone applications are currently able to detect anyone who has the same hobbies around us. This allows us to get to know anyone without having to look again at their background. 2. How to socialize. Once upon a time, the only way to socialize was face to face or by sending letters. However, this method is outdated and starting to be abandoned. 3. Entangled with cyberspace. There have been many studies explaining that the virtual world does make anyone addicted. Moreover, since the emergence of Facebook, anyone will want to spend time there. 4. Decreased ability to remember. According to a study, one in three people under three under the age of 30 in the UK can no longer remember their phone number by root. This is because people are starting to underestimate small pieces of information such as their phone number. Pipe like of empathy in terms of digest information, we also begin to change from Time to time, this is also so scientifically in an MRA test. In the test, the part of the brain that soul glow when it notice an interesting or touching even no longer so the skin. If in the past humans were able to understand other people's feelings from a different point of view, now they are not. Six different on gadgets. A survey released this year so that people age 18 to 30 can no longer travel without the help of GPS or satellite based, based direction. 7. The emergence of a 
new phobia this is stated in a study of several teenager according to therapist Michelle Hauser today then also begin to feel real real space is they are not connect it connect to this various communication tools for a will a procrastination becomes common place the the internet pool legends According to a study conducted by Pistil, the number of people who have started procrastinating has increased since the advent of the material. Seven director, the way of communication is also becoming more rugged nowadays. This is become the way to communicate and social is Asian nowadays. Ten technology attack like a virus. A study conducted by Gary Smalltree to compare the brain activity of those who frequently, frequently as the internet and those who do not. People who have never used internet are told how to sort in cyberspace and compare their brain activity. 11. Privacy is pounded. Since the emergence of the Facebook era, it seems as if someone Privacy and confidentiality are no longer a luxury. Anyone can pin out the background and what other people are doing. Some examples of people habits of using smartphone only. First picture, read a pick up who is busy in the bag, send message or to social media. It's the same in a museum, not enjoying our object, even busy chatting too. All young people hanging out on the beach instead of being busy hanging out the enjoying the beach atmosphere busy himself with his smartphone then why go to the beach crowded and conclusion Albert Einstein once said something like this I am afraid that today technology will bypass the interaction between humans in the world and have a generation of idiots that's the world before a lot of technology used by humans as it is now the relationship between brains seem to be different from before it can be seen from everyone today the habit of using only smartphone and the impact of technology and even then has many negative impacts on our lives I think that's all from me. Thank you for your listening. My all those we have shall be beneficial for all of us. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.